blind, girl. Queen, queen. <laughs> hey sis welcome and welcome back so in today's video i'll be showing y'all how i got this dope ass blazer yes let's get into it so if you're new go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you're returning what's good what's popping sis y'all already know what's going on but again if you're new we do a bunch of diys over here i post a new diy every wednesday and a weekly vlog every friday so make sure y'all hit that post notification button so y'all don't miss out on any of those so y'all i love thrifting now i thrifted these pants i got the blazer from amazon i am going to list it down below in the description box if y'all want the link y'all can shop uh, my amazon store but yes, yeah, so I am basically cutting out detailed pieces off the pants, like belt buckles, zippers, pockets, etc. Like stuff like that that y'all want to use. Totally up to y'all which pieces that y'all want to use, but I like the bold pieces, of course. And you can play around with this because you don't need a lot on the front of the jacket. Um, so basically, I am just placing them around, seeing where I want them to go, cutting out extra pieces. So like in certain spots, I wanted to keep a lot of the red. Well, I ain't going to say a lot, but I still wanted some of the red to show. But I am taking my seam stripper and I am going ahead and distress parts of the jean that I wanted to give a little extra, a little oomph, you know. So right here, um, I'm going to just let y'all watch because it's pretty simple basically so yeah just enjoy the rest of this and I'll be back Okay, so, so we kind of got our layout. We're going to take our high glue gun and glue everything down. You want to glue the stuff that's already on top down first. Not that it really matters, but just to keep it where you already got it placed so you don't have to, you know, change things around or whatever. But yeah, that's what I'm doing now. Just gluing everything into place. Really simple, y'all. Like... For real and i got so many compliments on this jacket people was asking me was i d a designer when i was in la and i'm like no but i well i'm not a i am a designer but i didn't design here i'm modeling today or whatever but next time i definitely want to be a designer because the model experience it was definitely an experience y'all like but i'm gonna talk about that in my on friday vlog so y'all gotta stay tuned for that and right here this is the piece that i had extra i am just gonna put it on the back of the collar y'all and keep it simple i was gonna um write like some a dope little fashion statement in the back of the jacket but i decided not to um so i'm just gonna do it right here i'm just gonna write real is rare on the sleeve and then i'm gonna you know Splash the little paint over there or whatever and y'all I don't have the best penmanship but I wanted it to be like raw I wanted it to be like you know so that's what I did and y'all some of the stuff I forgot to record because this was literally I think I made this like a day or two before I left so I'm taking some bleach and I am bleaching certain spots, certain areas that I want it to be bleached. Um, I don't want it to be a whole lot, but I do want to put some extra little white on there to just open it up. You know, a little razzle dazzle. So let's get into it. But yeah, this is the final and finishing look. I hope y'all like it. I loved it. And so many people in LA loved it as well. Make sure y'all follow me on all social media platforms. Shop my Amazon storefront. See right here, she was asking about the jacket. She was asking about my information. 
and I just love Bay so much because he got you know me in action and looks so right back to right back to it okay let's get it down this red carpet you see me don't play with me sis but go ahead and subscribe for more vlogs more videos more DIYs I love y'all so much and I'm out peace